What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Amanda Nunez. Amanda Nunez faced off against Holly Holm, which is a much anticipated bantamweight fight, and it was over in round one, people. You know, it was rather ironic to me, symbolic to me at the same time, that Amanda Nunez was able to throw a Van Damme style roundhouse, just like Holly Holmes did, to stop the industry or the or would be or granted chinned solid Ronda Rousey and put her out of her commission. The same thing happened to Holly Holmes by Nunez. Okay. Nunez at this point. Beat Cyborg, much anticipated. Cyborg was ducked by uh, Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey got hers too, was spared because she could have got a much worse ass beating from Nunez, but was beat all the same, but was spared, right? Uh, Misha Tate <clears throat> took out Holly Holmes, right? And she got hers too. She got busted up and then submitted round one. Holly Holmes, round one. Ronda Rousey, round one. Cyborg, round one. Let me tell you something. There's nothing else Nunez should do at this point unless there's somebody that's hungry that I forgot or I missed. But as of the top bantamweight fighters, she's done it all. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's just like someone like uh, Oscar Rivas, right? That's somebody like Rivas coming in, taking out Dillian White, then taking out Anthony Joshua, then taking out Deontay Wilder, then taking out Tyson Fury. That's like the same shit. That's someone that comes in that's hungry, that's that wants it, that's driven. Okay, you hear me talking about driven. Driven is a powerful word. Okay, it's a very, very, very powerful uh word it's a powerful statement rather okay that type of shit happens when you are focused on what you want to do you know and nunez has done it she's done what people thought she couldn't do because when cyborg was around i've seen cyborg go head up with clarissa shields in a very highly anticipated boxing match. Okay, this is a boxing channel. And the thing I love about combat overall is that you know certain things work for you. I don't know what the hell Holly Holmes was doing, honestly. I think she was, she faked the right which she didn't need to do she should have just threw it and commit to it but if you're going to commit to anything you should cover your opposite side and she did not do that and she got roundhouse and paid a price for it just like she did ronda rousey so the lioness prevails once again the chick is a force to definitely be reckoned with you know, and she keeps proving people wrong. And now the thing is, all we have to do is wait because I can't really see any other resistance that could be in her path at this point. The only thing I can see is somebody that, you know, no one ever heard of that's able to do certain things. But like I said, Amanda Nunez is driven. So I think at this point, the only person that can beat Amanda Nunez is Amanda Nunes when she stops uh, desiring the spirit to be driven someone else will harness that spirit immobilize it and act on it but until then Amanda Nunes is the lioness is the person to beat is the creme de la creme in the bantamweight, bantamweight division bar none that's my counterpunch on that. You guys tell me what you think about Amanda Nunez. Of course, please subscribe. 
and you guys have been Counterpunch. Peace.